What's up guys, Zachary's Drive here, and I am back with a really quick video wondering if DirectX 12 is actually something we should have right now. Um, this is the first time I've actually experienced this, but uh, yeah, Forza 3 Horizon Edition just kind of went nuts on me. And uh, let's go ahead and share my screen real quick. Um, I have no idea what happened here. Uh, I just loaded the game and, and the entire game was it was like this, so let's just show you what what I'm talking about here. I don't know. I don't know what this is. Like is this mad artifacting right now? Or is this just a DirectX 12 thing? I can still play it and it still functions correctly. I mean it's very strange. I, I really can't really describe what's going on here. Um, I mean, I'm sure if I crash it, let's just try it real quick. Crash it. Bring it back up. I bet you it works just fine now. Um, so is this a DirectX 12 problem? Is this technology we shouldn't be messing with? It is still doing it. Huh. What's going on, guys? I'm gonna restart my computer real quick, I guess, and see if it's still doing it. Um, this would be bad if it's a failing video card. Actually, let's just check that real quick. We have the technology, we can do this. That looks correct. Let's just do our gauntlet of tests real quick. See if this is a DirectX 12 thing. I haven't set up yet, so... But yeah, you can see Grand Theft Auto 5 is loading. Like, it's... it looks like it's correct. Is, did it load my Steam? I don't know. I guess we'll find that out right now if it has cloud save or not. But yeah, this is just kind of a... Waking up in the morning and seeing my entire game not functioning correctly kind of video. Like... I, I'm not sure what's going on there. Was there an update? Was there something wrong with my GPU? Like, that, that would be the first thing I think of. Hey, I'm, it loaded my game. That was me uh, bringing up Steam Overlay, if you're wondering why it glitched. Yeah, no, this is working completely fine. I, mean, I don't know, guys. GTA runs, runs just fine. Let me go ahead and bring up, uh, let me bring up Doom. And I, I'm, I'm trying to make it so this is a, a, ah, where's my monitor capture? I'm trying to make it so this is a constant video so you can see like my thought process and what I'm trying to do to figure out what's actually wrong here. Um, hey kiddo, what's up? Uh, I wear a superhero. You want a superhero cape? Okay. Come here. 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 Thinking. Oh, here we go. Wow, that took a very long time. Uh, you guys can't see it. Game capture doom. Um, yeah, I'm not sure now. Like, that's very strange. 
Let's just load into a level to make sure it's going. Anyway, guys, this is the, the, the thought process and the, the steps that I take to diagnose something. Like, like I said, I woke up and that was not working. So after I do these few games, I'm going to switch back to Forza and see if it's still doing it. If that's the case, I'll restart. Unfortunately, I can't live record a restart, but... Let's see. These games are all on a on a slower hard drive, so that might be why it's taking a bit while uh, longer to go. Um, I guess the alternative thing I can do is see if there's anything up in the Windows Store. Let's see if there's like an update I have to force. Come on, load faster! Oh my God! There we go. Oh, the frame rate's not as good when I'm uh, recording it. Of course it's not, because OBS loads uh, the CPU a bit. Yeah, you can see right there, 110, 120 frames. If you guys got a, a 120 refresh or 144, you can definitely appreciate this game. I'm only recording this at 30 frames per second, like a dummy. Oh well. Oh uh, no. And see if it continues the problem. Um OBS can't actually properly capture Forza. Yeah, it's still doing it. I have no idea. Let me check store. Maybe there's an update. I don't know. I guess I'll be right back and see if restarting it fixes the problem. Alright, it's still loading up. I gotta wait for all these to, to load. And that was the last one. So let's try it now. What? It works just fine now. So there you go guys, that was a live test of uh, diagnosing a DirectX 12 game. That's about as live as you can get because I can't record during the restart, but uh... Works just fine now. I, I, I don't know what to say. I don't know if that was just a weird boot up thing or, or what exactly happened there, but uh... It works now. If anybody has any idea what was going on there, let me know. Uh, I'd love to know. Because if there's no way to fix that besides a restart, that's kind of stupid. And, I mean, DirectX 12 is a new uh, technology, so... It still has some bugs. That's why we're waiting for DirectX 12.1 and stuff like that. So, anyway guys, that's it for me. This is Axitech trying to diagnose... Um, video problems. You can see it runs perfectly fine now. So, whatever. I don't know. Let me know in the comments what you think it was. Uh, every other game was working fine. <laughs> okay, thanks. Bye.